May I say welcome? My name is Dr. Ian Malcolm. You may have heard of me. Well, correction, you should have heard of me, especially now that you're here. So before you are the islands that you need to manage, if you can. The five deaths. Jeez, if only, if only there had been five. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is as good a place as any to begin. Isla Matanceros. It's relatively stable. Yeah, you can uh, you can get your feet wet here, and you should. Just diving into the deep end of the pool is where the big, angry, hungry things are, and uh, you want to be ready before you try that. Yeah, <laughs> that that's true. So, uh, hello. That's. I'm Cabot Finch, public relations and crisis management, and I'm here to help you. Okay. You'll start by building a Hammond Creation Lab. Anyway, I. We've already started on an enclosure for you. You should just attach it to the side, but watch out for dinosaurs. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Right. So it's me, uh, Diamond Z. And, uh, this is Jurassic World Evolution. Um. I'm gonna record one episode of this and see how everyone likes See how you like it. Focus on what you're here to do, which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. Actually, Las Cinco Muertes. <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. Okay. Hey, anyway, I'm gonna get away from that construction. You'll need to connect it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. Thousand, now really? Now comes the real test. Incubating a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the creation lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. Can you stop talking? <laughs> this guy like never stops talking. It, anyway, um, yeah, Jurassic World Evolution. I'm gonna see how you guys uh, like this and if I should continue with it. Cause I've played this game before. Um, and I like I like it. I personally like it. So got a streaky mimus here. Just... The machinations of the ambitious, undoing extinction, playing with nature's laws. What can possibly go wrong? Come on, Doctor. You know we've learned so much, and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Yes, Mr. Finch, yes, the, the last time. There's always a last time, and a next. We good? Hey, it's done. Life, it begins. The most precious moment, the result of incalculable actions and reactions, trials and errors, genetic mutations and unknowable combinations, chaos, <laughs> all leading to a living, breathing, thinking being, an entity, distinct and unique. And now we, you, just manufacture them. So, well done, I guess. <laughs> wow, very enthusiastic there, um, Jeff. That's, uh, that's cute. <laughs> big, big, big eyes, though. That's very big eyes. Oh, no, I learned it. The Hammond Foundation has three main areas oh. of interest. Security, entertainment, and science. I've already nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. Okay. So, when I've played this last time, uh, entertainment's really good. So, I start with entertainment. I'm Isaac. 
I've been hearing good things about you. I'm in charge of the entertainment division here. What good is the world's greatest show if no one sees it? Don't answer. That's rhetorical and painfully obvious. What I'm saying is that we need people in our parks. Fill up our facilities with warm bodies. Numbers bring revenue, excitement, and opportunities. Right. So we need to build an expedition center. Contracts can be requested from the division uh, right inside the control room. Complete these to increase your reputation and gain additional revenue to keep expanding your park. I was trying to get on the very edge of that of the sub substation. So one more thing, your reputation, your rep, quote unquote. Keep an eye on it, okay? If you have a solid reputation with a division, you're more likely to benefit from them. Financially, I mean. Okay. But, like life, it's a balancing act. Each division is vying for your attention, and if they don't get it, they tend to take it personally. Okay. <laughs> I've actually never, um, had anything happen. Like anything bad. I've never had anything bad happen, so. Is taking notice of your success. As your reputation increases with them, so too does the opportunity to tackle more challenging missions. This looks really nice. I don't need the help. Get out of here. I don't need it. I might as well take a look at it. I'm Claire Deering, and I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, I made some mistakes, and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing, and I believe in these dinosaurs. Right. Responsible management of our animals is key, as is creating a safe environment for our visitors. Correct. What's happening? Oh, it's the mission. Okay. That's why. Stratosaurus. Um, yeah. It's just, well, management. Nothing too important. Hey, it's Isaac. How you doing? I got some cool stuff you need to be a part of, so I'm putting it out there. Come on and help the winning team. Uh, right there. Mine. <laughs> Gotta go get, uh, some Stratosaurus DNA. I think we have... I think we actually have... I am all about the show. These dinosaurs... We have one unlike any other on the planet. Theme parks rely on drawing people in. And what is more attractive than new dinosaurs? Well, me, of course. <laughs> yeah, no, what I'm saying is let's Ooh. get some fresh dinos in the hopper. Ooh. Okay, that's that's good right there. Good. Your first expedition team is out. They'll bring back what they find to the fossil center for extraction. Um, yeah, um, researching all the, uh, treatment, the uh, darted treatments, that's important. Your job is simple, really. Create dinosaurs which attract visitors to your facilities, brings in capital, money, huh? Which means you can do more research to build better facilities and create more dinosaurs, and there you go. A circle of life, development and resources, nature and commerce. See? Simple. I I get irritated by all the, like the news and stuff that I have to like. I have to click on all of it. There we go. Okay. Let's check what we got in here. We got Strathmore, Stratosaurus, Monosaurus, Triceratops, uh, Acrocanthosaurus, Albertosaurus, Allosaurus, Ankylosaurus, Apatosaurus. I don't remember that one. Uh, Baryonyx, Brachiosaurus, Camarasaurus, Carcharodontosaurus, Carnotaurus, Cat. Chasmosaurus, some stegosaur of some kind. That's the calm I think. Really small. Uh, Critosaurus, Cri uh, wait, what is that? Calosaur. Denonicus, Dilophosaurus, Diplodocus, Draco Rex, I think. Or maybe that's Digimolic. Oh, I don't know. I actually don't know what that one is. Um. I don't know that either. That's the Eupocephalus. Gallimimus. Don't. I think that's a uh, Giganotosaurus. Don't. I don't know that one. Uh. Herarosaurus. Got nothing for that. Got nothing for that. Iguanodon. I can see the thumb right there. I don't care about the help screen. Cantrosaurus, I think. 
My uh, Myasaur? Uh, Majungasaurus? Oh, Pachycephalosaurus, Parasaurolophus, uh, Sinoceratops, Spinosaurus, Stegosaurus. I think that's Siggy Moloch. You should extract genomes from fossils that have been collected inside your fossil center. That will increase the amount of viable data you have to create dinosaurs. Styracosaurus, Sycamimus. That's Taurosaurus because it looks like the trike. I don't know these ones. It's T Rex Vel Velociraptor. I think that's Nodosaurus. I think. I think that's Nasutoceratops. I don't know what that one is. It's got like a fan on its head though. Like, uh, actually, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna stop pretending I know stuff. Uh, oh. That's some good amber right there. Big sites. We have the Morrison formation. Rhenium. A rare heavy metal using jet and rocket engines. Nice. Uh, hookworms. A type of intestinal parasite from the round worm group. A uh, number of worms will typically determine the symptoms for in the initial infection. These include rashes, abdominal pain, and diarrhea. Infection can spread through contaminated dung or food sources with hygiene being the most effective preventative action. And, you know, you got the, the comical. Nothing too special about that. It's, it's common. Uh, while I'm in here... I was looking at another Struthiomimus. Oh, a thud. It scared me a little bit. Uh, okay. I, I, he might want me to incubate a Ceratosaurus. So I'm going to go ahead and make an enclosure for it. Oh, what the heck? Oh, it's curving. Okay, no, I don't want that. Well, I guess here would be okay to curve, but... Um... That looks okay. I'll think. Hey, Stratosaurus. Incubate and release it. I don't know what's worse, treating these creatures like grist for the mill or propping them up as curiosities. I don't know if he's talking about the Stratosaurus or he's talking about the Struthiomimus that just got released. Oh my god. Oh. Um, no, wrong thing. Dummy. Uh, yeah. Gotta get him a food source. Got a boosh. My advice? Keep your animals well fed. Especially in situations like this. There's a bush behind you. Get it. Oh, there it goes. Oh. <laughs> it's run into it. Nice. Um, right. I think we're going to need an ACU center for this uh, specific task. There we go. Again, I'm just trying to get him like right on the edge of the power from this one substation. So I can maximize space if I do that. Hmm. Rhodium. Right, more stratosaurus. I'm losing money. Okay, let's just incubate the stratosaurus right now. Ah, Dr. Dua. This is our new Director of Operations. I'm aware, Cabot. I'm Dr. Dewar. I run the Science Division of our operation. Okay, you're going to need to build your reputation in the Science Division. Not easy with me around, but you'll manage. That means managing our dinosaur population and seeing that they are flourishing. Now, if I remember from the past, some of your contracts don't really follow that. Stratosaurus. I forgot that they did that. 
Um, yeah. Kajal. Yeah. I, f I feel like it. There's a deep sound in these headphones with that with that sort of source. Relax. Uh, discovery. Found in Cleveland Lloyd Dinosaur Quarry in Utah. Dry Mesa in Colorado. Uh, later finds in Portugal. Another, you know, evidence that, uh, what was it, uh, continental drift. Yeah, that, that's the theory. That is unfortunate. Go again. Try to get, I know. One of your dinosaurs has failed to incubate. Oh, why is my dog barking? I never said bringing back dinosaurs was gonna be easy. Why is my dog barking? She needs to stop that. I don't have an ACU center, so we can... Uh, I don't know. Any skins? Oh, no, nothing good. Okay, well, that's sad. Oh, it's got the security division um, emblem on it. What is going on? Something weird is going on. It's, it, mouse isn't, like... Okay, that's fine. I'm just not looking at it properly. Well, jeez, you guys are right on top of each other. Relax. If you're communicating, you don't need to be that close and <laughs> blow each other's eardrums out. That was very easy. This is exactly what I needed. Well done. Oh, now she's giving me a, the a, her science mission. Um, Triceratops. Not right now because I'm working with Isaac. for you to consider. It will allow us to work together to create life. Pure life. If you've been listening to Dr. Malcolm, then you know how important this is to us. And to me. <sighs> uh, whoops, wrong thing. Let's do some landscaping. I don't... I need to see this to... I need to, like, see the enclosure. Should be good enough. A little water source. Setting additional task. I want the I want them to do it. Our job, no, our mission in raising these animals is to provide an environment for them to thrive. Your habitat is too small for them. Are you high? I don't know what you've been smoking, but look at this enclosure. It's massive. Also, will you please knock that thing out, please? Will you please KO it? Oh, they hit it. Happy guest is what we strive to maintain here on the islands. We do that by making sure they're oh, okay. Met. Close. In a way, it's kind of like taking care of the dinos, just with uh, less understanding. <laughs> Am I right? Build a fast food restaurant. I'll build one there. I have to research a clothes shop. Which is that? 200,000? Okay, I can do that. Okay, so for the next one, I'm gonna need to get trike. So let's do that right now. Nice. Ew. So many helicopters in the air all at once. This is. make me nervous. I don't know why. That's not in the doing what I want it to do. I think that should be good. Hey, we can build a clothes shop. Oh, I can't build it though. Are good here, huh? I love what you're doing. Build a clothes shop and build a viewing gallery. Let's all build it here because of the food source. Um, I'm gonna need a substation to power this it looks thing. Like out of power. That's not good. Build more power stations. There we go. Increase your output. Oh, now my expedition center doesn't have any power. 
News to eight. What do you mean? I'm Owen Grady. Owen to my friends. I've seen things I'd rather not talk about, but it hasn't dampened my commitment to the dinosaurs. The raptors more generally, and me and Blue specifically. We have a special relationship, like what I have with Claire. Less complicated. Anyway, nice to meet you. No. 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 You're not Owen. That's not Chris Pratt. No. I like what I'm seeing. Let's keep it up. Satisfaction Shit. is what we aim to give our guests. Make them appreciate the little things. And the big things with the teeth and glassy eyes that can swallow the whole. Uh, interesting. Need to maximize profits off of these things. I need money. Sell a, sh sell a hat for $10. What was that? Oh, it's just the monorail. Construct a live bait feeder. I would, but I only have eighteen dollars now. <laughs> yes! Oh, I got a million dollars. We got Draco Rex as well. We've got a park running at maximum happiness, and our guest numbers are up as a result. That's what makes the entertainment division envy of the rest. We get the results, am I right? When the parks are running well, our scientific research improves. Of course, I'd never tell this to Isaac directly. Heard it. Mm, I, I was going to add that... No. No. No, 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 no. Too late. Heard it. Later, Doc. Ugh. Stop it! I was trying to- Are you gonna eat, sir? Where's that goat? Oh my god, wait. There's like bass behind, behind those footsteps. Oh, here's the goat. Or, goat, turn around. I want to see the strategy to save the goat. <laughs> He's watching him build the power station. That's funny. He's looking at him. Oh, he's gonna eat the goat. Oh, I swear there's bass behind these footsteps. Oh, wow, he got really slow there. Eat him! Now oh, that's epic. That is epic. Um... Okay. We're gonna get... Hey, you know what? I can do that, Lambert. Security. Yours, theirs, and mine. Welcome to the islands. So here's our basic conundrum. We want to keep our animals under control oh, wait a minute. while simultaneously encouraging instinctive behaviors because these animals have potential as Oh, we got an arid skin but there. Interesting. Everyone's fear object, myself included, is to have these animals running free and loose in the park. But we can't exploit them globally without taking some chances. Oh. Sounds risky. We're gonna get these, uh, trike fossils and then we'll go ahead and end it there. <laughs> Huge interest for the park, um, for the, for Jurassic Park, the Jurassic Park game. Uh, Malcolm commented on their size, wondering, what they got in there? King Kong? I, I, never mind. It's not, he's staring at my soul. 
This isn't Owen. Mm. Alright, whatever. More, more characters. What? Oh, Tim Murphy and Rowan Timbo. That's the guy I was trying to hunt that uh, T Rex was Timbo. <laughs> I've spent enough time in the company of death. <laughs> come on, come back. Oh, here we go. Why don't I get a Triceratops in here? We'll get these fossils, send back for more Triceratops um, fossils, and then we'll end it there. Right, right after I send them. Right. Hey, Amber! Alright. We got the Hill Creek Formation. One of the most famous and most studied dinosaur fossil sites. Montana, North and South Dakota, and Wyoming. That's a lot of sp that's a lot of area that, that that's covering. Oh, Draco Rex is over there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna end it here. I'll probably finish this um this raiding. Uh, off camera. Well, maybe I can do it right now with the Triceratops. I don't know. But I need to like set myself like a like a like a time limit on these for obvious reasons. I don't want to go too long and then you know. I just hold ten percent. I know that I didn't know the amber did that. That's awesome. That's epic. All right, well, we can be a trike, and then we'll call it a day. How about that? Let's check it out in the database. There it is. Nice. Ah, here we go. 2010, a controversial theory was proposed that the trike was actually an immature form of Taurosaurus. I don't believe it. I think it's just... I think it's just a Triceratops. Like, it's... It's... More known than the, than the Taurosaurus, so... Hey, we're making, making a profit. I think if I get this trike, I'll get my dinosaur rating up. Oh, I didn't see the gate. Je oh my gosh. Uh, Jurassic World, Isla Matanceros. Nice, I guess I could look it up from over here. But then that's also, that's not as fun. I wonder if... Oh. No, this is light steel, that's not heavy steel. Oh, that's a weak fence. Oh, I can't wait for the security mission. <laughs> I wonder what it's gonna be. Based on what um, that was a bad voice crack. Based on what um Lambert said, like taking chances. Are we gonna let Are we gonna let the Stratosaurus loose for his mission, or something like that? Oh, I forgot, we can also name them. Yeah. If you got any name ideas, leave them below. Like, say what dinosaur it is, and then say, uh, and then, like, put a name in for it. Oh, he's gonna roar. Nice. We also have Triceratops. And I don't care about the dick team right now. Nice. <laughs> I see you've hatched a triceratops. It might be cute now, but that's only gonna last for about a week. Hey! Don't say that about my triceratops. I have a frill though, I'm done. Um if you, guys, if you guys want me to continue, I'll continue. But for now, I'm out. See you.